Now what we're working on today is probably one of the simplest breakfasts you can make and it's so easy to do, especially if you've already got your protein prepared. So right here, I baked some chicken last night uh, for about 30 minutes. So I've got my chicken prepped already. I've just got some eggs right here, some cooking spray, and I'm gonna throw some salsa on it. So I'm just gonna fire up the stove here. Spray my pan down so that the eggs don't stick. And then basically all I'm gonna do is take one of these quarter chickens right here, and I'm just gonna plate it and throw it in the microwave. And then when the eggs are done, I'm just gonna throw this whole thing together. And then you've got a basic breakfast. Now, depending on what your goal is, you may wanna go more or less here. Um, if you want weight loss, uh, I would recommend going anywhere between one to three eggs. If you're going for testosterone boosting and amplifying by using more healthy fats, I would say you could even go four or five whole eggs on this. The leanness, uh, as far as if you're trying to get shredded, getting some six pack abs or leaning up, uh, go whole eggs, I would say stick to whole eggs and only do two to three eggs. Um, don't worry about egg whites or separating. The yolk's actually one of the healthiest parts of the egg. The yolk's gotten a bad rap in the past as far as the, the fat content in it and the cholesterol and bad cholesterol versus good cholesterol, but actually it's just good cholesterol and proteins and that's where all the nutrients are in the eggs. So stick to whole eggs either way you're going. If you're going for gaining muscle mass, I would say don't go overboard or more than like five whole eggs. I would just say beef up on your meat a lot more. Like if you wanted to go between eight to 16 ounces of meat even in the morning for breakfast or if you wanted to make this a dinner option too, that would be great for dinner. So use whatever seasonings that you want on your eggs or on your chicken, whatever you may be doing. Like I said, I'm gonna be using this is Renfro's habanero salsa to throw on my eggs and I'll probably do a little bit of sea salt on there too, which I've got right here. So I just got some Morton sea salt that I'll be throwing on. And this total prep time, cooking the eggs and everything, even waiting for the pan to heat up here is probably only gonna be 10 max of 15 minutes since we're just microwaving the chicken. So I typically like doing four eggs for breakfast and then doing another four eggs for my post-workout. We've got our pan nice and hot here. So we go ahead and crack my eggs. We've got just four large eggs that I'm gonna be using. And now there's always a debate going on, waging war on the internet, magazines, wherever. Uh, as to if white eggs or brown eggs are healthier and there's not really a difference. The only difference is buying natural or organic and there's nothing special about this. So if you're going budget saving, I would just totally recommend buying regular eggs. I usually buy them in 18 packs because I'll go through six to eight eggs a day. So I'll buy those in bulk. So then you've kind of got the layout of this basic breakfast that I'm making here. I've got my chicken right here. I've got my eggs cooking up. And it looks like those whites are getting to the point where I want to flip them. I usually like doing my eggs over medium. If you like scrambled, if you like over easy, if you like sunny side up, whatever your preference is with eggs, go for your preference. Go for your favorite. So let's see if I can get my flip down today. And got it. So I'll just check those yolks a little bit and they're almost completely cooked. So I'm just gonna give them a second or two on this side and then I'm gonna go ahead and add it to my chicken plate right here. And go ahead and shut off the heat. Perfect, now I'm gonna get my seasonings that I'm gonna use on this. So for breakfast this morning, I'm gonna go with this uh, chipotle and roasted garlic seasoning. This is really great. This has become one of my favorite seasonings to put on eggs. Now that these guys are done. And go ahead and drop them off. Make sure you don't fall off the plate right there. And then just really simple. And as I said before, all I did was heat up this chicken in the microwave. It's something that I had baked the night before. I'm just gonna sprinkle this on to taste. I always have to warn you guys, I'm kinda heavy handed when it comes to seasonings because I love making things taste wonderful. A little bit of Mrs. Renfro's salsa. And boom. Got it, that's your basic breakfast right there. Like I said, you can add a variety of stuff to this. If you wanna do spinach, if you wanna do kale, make it a scramble with either one of those. If you're gonna do 
sweet potatoes. You can either chop those up or I like steaming mine in the microwave, poking some holes in it so that it gets nice and mushy. Um, you just wrap it in saran wrap and stick it in the microwave on your uh, potato setting and um, enjoy. That's it.